If you're looking to do a slow zoom in in Final Cut Pro, or maybe you want to do a jump cut where it's zoomed in, I'll show you how to do both of these effects within Final Cut Pro. Now to do the jump cut zoom in, it's really simple. Wherever you want that jump cut zoom in to begin, all you have to do is split the clip where you want. So I'm doing Command B to split the clip in half. And then for the second clip, I'm going to the transform tool and I'm doing a scale in. And then I'm dragging my video up to where I am zoomed in. So that way when I click play and get to that spot, it does a nice zoom in, a harsh cut, and it'll zoom in. And then wherever I want it to zoom back in, I just do command B again to split this clip. So this part's the zoomed in part. And then here I can change these each back to 100 and then move this back up there and then I have it back to normal. So now it'll do a little zoom in and go back to normal. Now, in order to do a smooth zoom in or super fast zoom in, we have to use something called keyframes, which if we click on our video and hover over here, you'll see it'll say add a keyframe. So we wanna add keyframe to a position and add a keyframe to scale. And how keyframes work is it pays attention to changes made from one keyframe point to the other keyframe point, which kind of allows you to animate a bit. So at this point, nothing has changed. And so we can scroll ahead in the video. And if we make changes here, it'll slowly move to those changes. So I can increase the size of this and I can move it a little bit towards my eyes there. And because we put a keyframe point here and it'll usually automatic do it if you've already selected the keyframes, it'll slowly make those changes over that period of time. Now, if you wanna do a super fast zoom in, you just have to get the keyframe points a little bit closer to each other. So I'll just scroll ahead a few frames um, and then do my scale in and it'll add those keyframe points in. And now when I click play, it's gonna do a very rapid zoom in on my face. If you wanna learn other cool effects you can do with Final Cut Pro, click on this playlist. I've put together all the best tricks. So definitely check this out.